the clouds have been gradually breaking up as we've gone through this afternoon, and with it, it's turned into a pretty good latter part of the day, although it's been cold out there. Temperatures have been running in the 30s throughout the course of the day, but this is from our Kentucky One Health weather bug camera located at St. Joseph Jesmond there in Nicholasville. So again, looking down there to the southwest, you're seeing the setting sun out there through the breaks in the cloud cover. Not bad at all. Max Track Live Doppler, nothing coming out of the sky. So here we go. What we're tracking for you tonight, another cold one in store for us tonight. For the weekend, windy and warmer and eventually wetter. The eight-day forecast. Winter officially starts on Thursday. It also looks to be the warmest day of the bunch. Real winter weather may follow. We will talk about some of that coming up. Mid-40s, still our normal high temperature, although it will be going down another notch tomorrow. Uh, today we've made 43, except that occurred in the pre-dawn hours. Upper 30s tomorrow, we'll push 40. We're going to push 50 on Saturday. That'll be nice. Mid-40s again on Sunday. And again, we're staying at and a little bit above normal into the middle of next week. Another dry air mass in place. This is modified Arctic air, that dew point down in the mid-teens. Uh, with it, though, look, this is, that's what's important today. No wind. It's calm. Mid-30s right now, Bluegrass Airport. So obviously your wind chill equals your temperature. Uh, Mid-30s pretty much everywhere you go, except up to the northeast where Flemingsburg's at 28. But Moorhead's at even freezing. Williamsburg comes in at 36. Danville's at freezing as well. So here's the setup. Lake effect snow coming down Lake Michigan there, hitting northern Indiana. Uh, you've got a few snow showers coming down off of Lake Erie, going across northeast Ohio into parts of Pennsylvania and West Virginia. But for us, those wind trajectories are not snowmaking, so we have been quiet today. Little bubble of high pressure sitting over Ohio tonight. The clipper that came by yesterday has gone down into the western Carolinas. It'll scoot on off to the east. The high sits in eastern Kentucky tomorrow morning. Gives us a cold start to the day. Activity up here to the north. That stays to the north for the most part. That cold front never gets here. In fact, by tomorrow, winds turn westerly, and they do begin to pick up. Those winds coming out of the west mean they're going to start bringing in Pacific air. What will happen then for us on Saturday in said Pacific air, we start a warm-up. And in fact, with southerly winds coming in Saturday, we will see a nice warm-up during the day. It does turn breezy as well, but these southerly winds eventually picking up moisture. So moisture begins to come north. Cold front begins to come our way Sunday. Put the two together. There's rain in your forecast to finish off the weekend. So from the kicks and giggles department, let's talk about this. This is looking at the upper air pattern. We're starting off, well, today. So big trough sitting up here in eastern Canada. There's your ridge out in the western part of the continent. That actually collapses a little bit early in the week. That's your little bit of a warm-up that comes in. But you notice that ridge begins to go back up again. That's the hump that you see right in there. When that happens, you start dislodging the Arctic air from way up here. Combine that with a ridge out here in the Atlantic that starts heading up toward Greenland. You squeeze the two, sends cold air southward. We're looking Saturday, which is the Christmas Eve Eve. But the bottom line is colder temperatures may be in the offing as we start looking a little further ahead. So let's enjoy what we've got before that. 20 tonight. Okay, it's your cold night tonight under a partly to mostly cloudy sky. It's a cloud sun mixed tomorrow on the chilly side. Can't really call it warm, but temperature's warmer than today. We will be warmer on Saturday, right up around 50. It'll be a breezy day. Rain moves in Sunday afternoon. We're in the mid-40s. We stay mild going into the early part of next week. We could hit 60 on the first day of winter. Hey. That's the top of the mountain. Yeah, Ooh. yeah. It's the valley on the other side that you got to worry about. Yeah, we get it's it. Just like sledding. Yeah, mm. I'm done with metaphors now. Okay. 